Hello, 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 everyone. Hello, I was, I almost said hello one, hello one, <laughs> hello everyone. Welcome back to One Piece Dungeons and Dragons Marines episode eleven, aka Halloween edition. Ooh. Ooh. This episode <laughs> better be spooky. <laughs> For yeah. anyone not listening and anyone watching, uh, you can see our incredible cosplays. We're all cosplaying all of the, all of our characters. You got Noble cosplaying Damien. Yeah, how's it going, everybody? Yeah. You've got uh, Kai cosplaying Tekken. Sorry, you Kai cosplaying Tekken. Sorry, right, sorry, right, Tekken right, cosplaying right. Kai. No, I got it. That's cool. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> we've hate we've got Spooky cosplaying Yokan. Um, hey. Tits and slang, by the way. Tits included. Um, <laughs> this is true. Oh, yeah. Wow. <laughs> and then we we got Briggs. Damn. For all our blind listeners, I have transformed into a fish man. My cosplay <laughs> is on point. It's a very experimental procedure, but it worked out perfectly. Yeah. <laughs> to be fair, he was cosplaying it, uh, at the beginning of the stream because I couldn't see him. Yeah, he, he quit, yeah. There. <laughs> yeah, we don't see him. I should just, I should just talk to like, like take my mic behind my camera and talk the entire time. Yeah, yeah no, seriously. <laughs> just put the green screen in front of you. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, I'm so sorry. I'm still a little sick. I, I cancelled East Kai D&D last week because I was sick. I'm still a little bit in terms of like coughing, so I apologize for potentially frequent coughing that might happen throughout this stream. It just happens when I talk a lot. Um, but we'll be fine. Well, I'm okay. I'm cosplaying Tiger, by the way. I didn't I didn't specify that. This, isn't, this is not how I usually dress. I have the backwards cap on. I've got the jacket, which is... I, and then I've got a t-shirt that has a tiger on it. Um, oh, that's cute. Aww. Yeah. So, Did you draw that yourself? No, no, but it looks like I could have. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, there I am. Uh, th last last time on One Piece D and D Marines, uh, Malice swung in with her weapon or demon form against Damien, who had finally slipped into uh, the armor that he created. And upon attacking Damien, she realizes that it has the ability to absorb fire and therefore just heal <laughs> and, and he took <laughs> barely any damage and now the, the the team is there um in in the art gallery malice huffing and puffing she looks wounded she looks beaten up uh but she still looks angry and determined um and it, it was i think it was literally just the end of her turn um mm. And we we go immediately to crab crab. <laughs> we start the episode with a bell death save, I believe, because she is at zero. I actually don't remember if she was death saved or she was stable, but she's at zero. So yeah, no, she has a death save. Sorry, Bell. Well, oh, she's she got a double back. crit. She the Ooh. first roll of the episode is Bell coming back with a twenty immediately. <laughs> she's like oh, just. She, <laughs> good. Holy moly. Okay. This flips back up onto the battlefield. All right. Okay. Well, <laughs> good, good for her. Time. I think that means she can do something as well, right? Like, I uh, yeah. 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 yeah, it does. But so, the entire, like, like Malice is on fire, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Belle's not going for anywhere close okay. to that shit. <laughs> but do you want Belle to do, Just like, grab it to die again? <laughs> It like roasts Bell, and yeah, Bell yeah, um, e immediately no. turns into like <laughs> into like cooked crab on a plate with like seasoning. Um, is there any? Yeah, Bell is gonna do something. Is there any kind of small hole in the wall that Bell can climb out of this room? <laughs> <laughs> she, <laughs> she, there's windows. She can smash a yeah. window. She's gonna go out the window and just hang out on the ledge while we're in here fighting because okay. she doesn't want to get turned into roasted crab. Bell will smash a window and then just like jump out. Fuck this. <laughs> uh, Yo Khan, yo, you're up. All right, uh, I'm going to run up next to her, but I'm going to stay ten feet away so I don't get burned to a crisp in between terms this time. Because yes, 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 yes. Oh, that's right. Arms, that, I can reach. Thanks for reminding me of that. Yeah. What just happened to my sheet? It's all good. Don't worry. Don't worry. You're scaring me. <laughs> I'm, okay. I'm adding the claws, um, the cat oh, claws, to your uh, thingy. So, oh hell yeah! So that means when you, whenever you do an unarmed strike, make sure you have claws ticked. It will do the extra. Oh no, it's already included. I what? already typed it in. Ah, I, I was trying to be. Yeah, I was trying to be cool. Yeah, you already did it. Never mind. Fuck, I'm an idiot. Just keep doing what you're doing. I, 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 I'm learning. I'm you're learning. learning. 
Oh, anyways, uh, I'm going to smack her with my quarter staff first over the head. Um, I don't think. Yeah, that, that doesn't hit. <clears throat> All right. Oh Jesus. Uh, okay. Then I'm just going to use a uh, flurry of blows to do two unarmed strikes and yep. try to knock her prone. Go wow. ahead. And none of them none hit. Of hit so you know what? You I'm just, just start swinging with your massive arms. You're still crispy. I'm just still crispy. Um, you're within. You're not within five feet of of her because of your no. long arms. So you're good. You're good. You're fine. I'm. Li- yeah. That's all I got though. Uh, it's Tiger's turn. Um, which I'm now cosplaying as. Hey guys, it's me, Tiger. Uh, Tiger got fucking battered, if I remember correctly. So he's on his knees, and he he gets up. He he dusts off the embers on his on his jacket, and he goes, "Hey guys, do you think I'll be the thumbnail this time?" <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know, Tiger. Bell still might do something cool this time. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Right. I don't know. We have a new cat girl Yokon. I don't think. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Cat girl Yokon. Yokon's done twice already. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, ti- whenever. Okay. Tiger's at a really wow. difficult situation right now because he could go in and attack Malice, but he is so low he will surely perish um, from just being close to Malice. So what he's gonna do is he's gonna second wind, which is a D10 mm-hmm. plus his level, right? Um, yeah. So he gets some stuff back. Yeah. And that means, oh wow, that's, that is a really good amount of health. Yeah. Uh, so you know what? That's a decent, decent amount of health, dude. Um, he's gonna jump in and fucking pounce at Malice, coming in with the wrist blades, hitting twice. He hits twice, a twenty-one and a twenty. He's on fire, in. baby. Yeah, yeah, he's on fire, he, actually. 69! 69! He's, hey, baby, you know what my favorite number is? It's 69. I have no idea why. Uh, and he slices. <laughs> I just like the way the numbers look. And he slices, cutting into the back of Malice's armor, dealing yeah, quite significant damage. Um, at the end of his turn, he will take 2d6 damage for being within range of Malice's fire, so he takes 11. So good. Jesus. So he essentially goes back to the health that he started his turn on, as the burn. And he's like, damn it, I will be on the thumbnail this time. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, I'd love it if he was on the thumbnail, but his face was just covered like Mike Wazowski by the Isekai, sorry, by the One Piece <laughs> Marines logo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Dave some sometime. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Okay, Kai, you're up. All right, I'm not getting caught on fire, so I'm just gonna go over here behind this one little uh, exhibit, and I'm just gonna fire my um, harpoon gun right at uh, Malice mm-hmm. with Mako's spear loaded up into it. So, do I do Mako's spear or the harpoon gun? Uh, it, it we, would, it would, it would, it would just be Mako's. Wait, wait, wait. I think. You, you, you. That's a very good point because they do do different damage, right? So, um, if you're inherently always using the Mako spear in the harpoon gun. Yeah. Um, I'm just gonna say that you you yeah you just it's in the harpoon gun. You use harpoon okay, gun. Okay, there we go. All right, cool. I'm using the harpoon gun. Yes, go ahead. Okay, okay. I believed in you. I gave you a second chance. You couldn't have just left. Um, that's a 16. I don't think a 16 hits. Shit. All right. Well. So the the harpoon gun fires forwards and just glances off of Malice's armor, her her, her devilish skin. And, yeah, and she looks around to you, Kai, and she goes, that, yeah. You don't understand. Do you, didn't you see Damien? Oh, Damien attacked Tiger, that's what happened. <laughs> yeah. yeah I didn't you yeah. see this man attack one of his own? I just... Oh, that's just Tiger. We all beat up Tiger every now and then. <laughs> <That's really, laughs> that is fact. That is fact. <laughs> I mean, just, if, if, the, if the reason why this thing is evil is because it attacked Tiger, like, that's not, like, yeah. proof, really, that it's evil. Sounds just like another Tuesday to me. (laughs) We would have taken care of it. You could have left and never in your sisters and you would have been fine. We would have dealt with this. Right, Bell? Where the fuck is Bell? (laughs) Shit. (laughs) You, you, but you don't understand, Kai. If they, I wanted Damien to put on that armor so I could prove to you guys the, how evil he was. I was overconfident and I thought that I would be able to, to, to take him down, two birds, one stone, take down the armor and take down Damien at the same time. I should have trusted in us. That's all I can say. Damien, you're not evil, right? Never have been. <laughs> you actually say that? Okay. I mean, yeah, see, I mean like, right I there. See, it. I trust my friend. 
Okay. Look, lady, I'm just obeying the law, and right now you decided to give give up our grace. We were about to let you go. You could have had your own life, and now you made the dumb decision of going against us once again. I can't overlook this. I don't care about my life. I only care about the lives of those that I care about, and those that I care about are, f are far away now. Uh, Damien, I guess it's your turn. All right, right then. Uh, I know. I I obviously noticed that I did target Tyga. So what I'm gonna try and do is recalibrate yes. the system. Yeah. Do you want to so. do like an intelligence check? If you if you do a successful intelligence check to sort of recalibrate the system, you will no longer need to be taking the wisdom uh, saves. All right. Well, we'll but it's a slightly harder of a check than the wisdom saves are. So, so is it intelligence save or just intelligence check? Um. Oh. Uh, oh, that's actually a really good point. Um, I, I think it's just an intelligence check. Okay. Because you're at, yeah. Oh! 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 Okay. Oh! <laughs> oh, I'm, oh, holy I'm glad. shit! This is why Bell got the fuck out of there and I'm hiding behind oh, something right no. now. <laughs> it is my armor. I should have advantage. <laughs> <laughs> to be, I, I do have to. You haven't used it in like what is it like twenty years? How old? Ten are years, you? Ten, ten years, it. ten years, ten years. I did make it. No, no, no. Twenty years, like it's about twenty, right? Holy um, shit! So you made it. Years would have, yeah. It up, so it's been a while. It's been a while, right? Um, yeah. <laughs> and maybe it's been like tampered with it is in my time. My life's work. You know? I'm in danger. <laughs> Oh, uh, to be honest, right? I, this is this is what happened. You you got a critical fail, dude. Um, you I, I you you're looking at your you, everything and and it and the the layout and the machinery and the 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 heads up display all looks quite different. And in the sort of twenty year period, it you could tell that some scientist that isn't you has been tampering with this suit to try and improve it, but hasn't actually like improved it in any way they've just made it more complicated it's like it when like, uh, it was like windows and now it's yeah. like running like uh, it's like it's, mac it's or on, something yeah it's on, even it's on mac ways. os now not even um, that it's like it's like some really shitty if, like i don't even know what a shitty actually, fucking os could be but damien like, whoever you, uh, there was probably a scientist that was like overseeing the project at the time who 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 would of that have been like god damn it yeah, yeah, yeah. It's running Linux. Do, do you have a, do you have a, do you have like a name for this for this guy? A name? Yeah, just give me a name and that's the guy who fucked it up for you. <laughs> God damn it, Jeopard. Jeopard. <laughs> Je so so like chief scientist Jeopard has installed Linux on your armor. Um, <laughs> and and it's like blue screening and you can't quite Oh shit. Oh no. So yeah, um I need you to roll a, I'm, you still have a chance of targeting Malice here, but you, um, one, two, three, four, five. Uh, you need to roll a D5. Num two is Malice, one is Yokan, three is Tiger, four is Bradley, oh, right and five is Kai. <laughs> I would like to I note included that I rolled, on the other side of the room. <laughs> I rolled a 17 stealth to hide in plain sight. Yeah, he's right, yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. okay. I'm right in the open, I, but I would I'm actually saying. say you're only targeting people in, in front of you then, actually. So roll okay. a D3. One Yokan, two Malice, three Tiger. Go ahead. Right. God speed gamers. Oh, Tiger! Sorry, Tiger. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, Tiger no. does have partial cover uh, behind Malice, technically. Yeah, yeah. Right behind, uh, yeah. yeah. So, so partial cover is something. Malice. So All go right. ahead. All right. Well, uh, well. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Well, Do the damage. No. So no. the the. <laughs> You know, oh, that's fine. It doesn't kill him. It just knocks him unconscious. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you, you, <laughs> you see, oh, like no. you see Jeopard's logo all over the screen. Um, he's installed like Clippy. Uh, so Clippy like pops up <laughs> in the armor and says, <laughs> "It seems like you're trying to uh, kill and do uh, murder. Do you want help with that?" Uh, what the it's, hell is this program inside of my machine? It's, it's not even Clippy. It? It's like it's like the knockoff of Clippy. It's the knockoff of Clippy. Well, what is Taylor like, the Thumbtack or the something? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a little Thumbtack. Um, he's got like arms and legs. And okay, so yeah, you just come round Malice and fucking. I guess you go around like the right or left of him, of her, and you just fucking. 
punch Tiger with such velocity. <laughs> oh, There's like this sorry, force Tiger. coming out of the gauntlet of the black armor, and Tiger just flies backwards, blood uh. <laughs> crushing Damn his mate. <laughs> spraying off what his the face. Fuck? Someone's messed with my armor. <laughs> no shit. <laughs> Yokon, oh, do wait. something. I, okay. Uh, I need I'm you. Try. Damien, Damien, you do now. After moving a punchy tiger away, the 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 only targets in front of you now are Malice and Yokon. Right. Um, so can you roll a D two for me? Am I still number one? Um. Yeah, you're still number one here. You are always number one. Yeah, you. So yeah. this one goes towards Malice. That's damn fucking right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, Tiger. <laughs> well, this one doesn't hit. Watch. It does okay, hit. No, no, no. That's not a crit, which is amazing to me. Mm. Holy shit. Uh, yeah, that's kind of insane. Yeah. So you just smash against Malice. Um. Uh, damn it. I uh, least one was on target there. <laughs> Um, and also, as my bonus action, I, can I use Chopper to try and hack in as yeah, well? Yeah, try and help I, me I would say if Chopper comes in next turn, you have advantage on the intelligence check. Okay, all right. Okay. Let, yeah, he'll He's like, okay, help me out here. Yeah. <laughs> oh. this is, something's <laughs> going on. Take care of this, Clippy. <laughs> tacky versus Tacky. Tacky, tacky the thumbtack is... <laughs> Tacky. That's the thumbnail. The thumbnail will just be Tacky the Thumbtack. <laughs> tacky the Thumbtack. <laughs> Instead of Tiger. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Right. So, uh, Bradley, you're up. Okay. From my perspective, it does kind of look like uh, Noble was trying to attack Malice and just ends up killing it. Because they were lined up, <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I'm behind them, like in, like in the third yeah. part of the you, row. Tiger's yeah, crumpled body falls in front of you, Bradley. Right? You see him there oh. lying on the ground, blood on his face, um, unconscious. It's okay, Tiger. I, I, I got you. <laughs> he looks like the family guy, like, death uh, pose. <laughs> <laughs> Yamcha yep. on the floor. Yeah, right. he's Yamcha on the ground. What do you want to do? Come on, Damien, learn how to aim that thing. I step over Tiger's body, stab him with a med kit real quick. I got, okay. That's my last one. Oh, yeah, then that's your bonus action to do that with your fast hands. Fast hands, yeah. Yeah, 2d4 plus 2. Do you want me to do it, or do you want to do it? Uh, you can do it. Okay, you don't want to You don't want to know if it's slash or R slash. Exactly. <laughs> and I'm right in front of Tiger's face as he wakes up. Welcome back to the world of the living, my friend. Oh, hey, man. Oh. Uh, Damien's going crazy. You gotta stop getting in the way of Damien's attacks. What okay. are you doing? You, you right. You, you right. You spit it. Actually, you right. Yeah. I'm telling you to stay away from me. Just let me fight. Yeah. Am I in range of malice? Yeah, you could run up and attack malice. Yeah. So I, I step over time oh, and stab him with sorry, the med kit. Uh, Damien, you are going to recover a couple hit points at the end of your turn. Wait, what? Because oh, uh, the fire from Malice absorbs into your armor, and the so you two got, like, temporary hit points now. No, no, he, he's not at full. Um, so you get nine hit points. Yeah, I'm not. Yeah. Okay, so plus nine to that. Okay. Yeah, because the oh. fire that is usually doing damage to everyone at the end of their turn is good, is healing Damien's black armor. Oh shit! Um, got it. Mm. Oh, so I should not get close then. I was about to run up and punch her. Well, that's at the end of your turn. You, you take the yeah, damage. Is, 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 is it a range around you, Malice? You, you take the damage if you end your turn within five feet of Malice. So you would be able to run up. Then then disengage. Well, you've used your bonus action to pick you up Tiger, so action, yeah. you wouldn't be able to disengage. No, you could use fast hands and disengage as a, as, as a thief. No, fast hands just lets you use items as a bonus action. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. Well then, I am going to stab Tiger and then run in the opposite direction. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go over like here. Yeah. And I'm just gonna use some piss man karate. Piss man karate. Yeah, go there ahead. Go. Uh, Do I get sneak attack? Uh, you, you should, you should get sneak engaged. attack oh. because he's engaged with Damien, yeah. Damien, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, I forgot Damien was an ally for a second. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not, I'm not, I am an ally, technically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Technically. <laughs> Go ahead, King. Piss on him. I'm clicking it. Yeah, it hits. Hey! Take that, you fiery bitch. <laughs> oh, wow, okay. Um, and that does 16 damage, which is pretty good. Um, she gets sloshed with this water, slicing into her into her side. 
Um, and she looks bloody and wounded. Um, she's on, like, very low. Mm. All right. Is this, like, Pokemon? Is my water damage super effective? <laughs> <laughs> she's not made of fire. Yeah. She just <laughs> has <laughs> fire. Uh, she's a demon. Um, okay, so Malice looks around and, uh, and sees the the Black Knight in front of her. To clarify, the Black Knight from the Harako Kingdom, not Blake the Black Knight, and not yeah. the Black Knight Duros from uh, <laughs> for Planet Duros. I know there's. Hello, everyone. I, I, I know that. As seen in One Piece D and D, Episode Thirty. Yeah, I I know that there are three black art suits of armors in One Piece. Wait, wait. D&D. There's three separate ones. There's... I thought they were all the same. No, thing. they're three separate. See, this is the confusion. What These the are shit, three right? separate suits of armor. Do you want me to clarify them all? <laughs> <laughs> At this point, kind of. Okay. Don't get don't get obsessed over that. Okay. okay it's fine. it's it's important, right? There's the Taraco suit of armor that Damien made, right? It's his life's work that he equipped it and killed a whole bunch of soldiers that were protecting Jasper and Taraco, right? Okay. Then there is the uh, the black suit of armor that V made. Uh, that he's that Arzen sent into space that the alternative timeline Duros war that made him become immortal and also made him evil then the black armor that Blake may wears is not special in any way it's just the armor that he wears when he's the okay. black knight and I so really sh- should have made it a different color <laughs> the shield friend that's all part of the armor that V made yes yes Okay. So is there All technically right. four sets of armor? One from like this timeline of ours and I one guess from technically, the yes. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Great. What about more. Blue Blood's armor? Was it black? No, <laughs> no. <laughs> he didn't have armor. Okay. I think he had armor. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, All right black. then. All right. So add that to the wiki, loyal listeners. There you go. Yeah. Okay, so I, I apologize. Wait, loyal listeners know the difference, but there's a lot of people who get very confused. <laughs> so there you go. Um, they're all different shades of black. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, all yeah. Right. 50 shades of black. Um, they, um, gotcha. Yeah. Um, okay, Malice looks at Damien, fury and anger in her eyes. Um... Uh, and she, she starts breathing heavily, the flames licking around her body. And she looks around. And I'm gonna have I'm gonna have her do a, a, a sort of I guess a wisdom. Okay. Um Okay. She 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 looks around and she starts to sort of calm down as the blood and the pain becomes so much. And she looks Damien dead in the eyes and says, If you arrest me now, do you promise that you'll leave this island alone and you'll let all of my sisters live? That was the plan. But then she turns to the rest of the crew and says, Do you guys promise? that the, after I give up and I am arrested that Damien leaves this black armor and he never wears it again yes I think I can agree to that you okay with that Damien I think we gotta give it to our higher ups <laughs> yeah <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm curious to hear Damien's thoughts what is it that you have so much against this stupid armor? I, I wouldn't say stupid. Yeah, yeah. yeah so this, <laughs> this glorious armor. This glorious armor. It is a tool, much like things that you use, like a cook uses a spatula. Or a fisherman. Uses a fishing spear. It is just a weapon. It's a weapon of mass destruction that in the wrong hands brings untold death to innocent people. Innocent people? Hardly. Most of those soldiers were civilians, Damien. Just military could, you know. Y- y- yes, maybe they were rebels, but you ever think that sometimes kingdoms are led by corrupt men? Do you ever think that sometimes the law isn't always 
Right. The laws exist to protect people, dissuade criminals like you from doing bad things. You could have just arrested them! But you decided to slaughter them! They decided they wanted to fight. What they other choice they did they have? Surrendering. But they didn't do that, did they? They would have been killed by the king if they surrendered. They had no other choice but to fight. And who put that king in power? It was you. It was none of us. Kings... Are, it's not... Kings aren't democratic. It's just birth lines and blood lines and... To blame the navy for the fault of your own kingdom is... Just naive. Sounds like Are you guys should have to help rebelled kings? against <laughs> your king. It sounds like you guys should have rebelled against your king and not the world government. That's what we were doing! I'm sorry, what but does it, democratic but, mean? But the king was obviously a, a navy, a marine puppet! Okay. I mean, he was... <sighs> this, this, I mean, like, Damien, you have to admit, like, she... Th 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 maybe life is a little bit more complicated. I mean, she seems very upset by this. Maybe sometimes people are thrust into a situation where they couldn't possibly, you everyone know, it's not just an easy solution, you know? In life, but you can't sympathize with everyone that has problems. Yes, you can. You know, things aren't always okay. black and white. <laughs> <laughs> For example, I'm blue. It's not logical. <laughs> the only thing that I know right now is that while I don't really understand much about these politics and wars, we're not at war right now so you don't really need this weapon you're perfectly strong without it oh, yeah our, our only mission is to give that to retrieve that armor it doesn't mean you have to use it we could just give it to our higher ups I vote we blast it into space but I'm not a scientist <laughs> so I don't know how to do that <laughs> but it seems like it would solve the problem I would say throw it under the water but uh, it might get dug up at some point I give up then. I, Thank you. I, I guarantee that nothing bad will happen to you or your sisters from now on. Good. Yeah. Just and while I don't owe you anything, I'm keeping that promise. Um, and I guess she just she she holds out her hand. She's on like single digit HP by yeah, the way. Yeah, yeah. Like this is yeah. this is why like she knows. Um, she holds up her wrists to 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 be arrested. Um. But she doesn't turn to, to Damien, she turns to Yokan. I'll take out some cuffs. Cuff her up. <laughs> Promise you'll leave this easel alone and this island? Yes. Mm. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, that's, this is combat over, so Damien, it's oh. entirely up to you <laughs> on whether or not you are adamant I, if you, if if you want to try and take off the armor, or if you want to stay in the armor. Well, I mean, well, we have to move it. Yes, and it's really heavy. <laughs> and, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, <laughs> that sounds like an excuse. No one can lift a giant woman over her head. I mean, I think she can carry the armor. <laughs> I can. The armor is like a ton. It is heavy. Yeah. We got Yokon. Yokon can lift it. I think, I think you're underselling Yokon, honestly. <laughs> that, okay, that, that, how heavy is this armor compared to Nini? Like, how heavy do you think Frankie is in all that armor? Yeah, it's probably that. Like, but we probably look it up. To, to be fair, there are like it's not it's not canon. There are it doesn't know. There yeah. are there are five of you. There's five of us plus a giant crab. By the way, where's well, Bell? Plus a <laughs> a uh, convict now. Yeah. I'm still gonna try and reprogram. <laughs> I still want to get. You Damien, wanna... out of pride, wants to try and reprogram. reprogram. That okay, go yeah. ahead. You have an advantage on this intelligence check, but I will yeah. say that if you fail this, you will be making two more attacks. Oh That's shit! Fine. What All does right. he have to beat? All right, let me just get rid of this stupid virus that's in my program. <laughs> oh god, <laughs> this is gonna suck. Uh, you see a sign. Okay. You see the like, 
22 22? is yeah, successful. Okay. You got it. I was say, you yeah, see yeah. that? You see like the there's like a pixel face of Jeopard, uh, which I'm for some reason I'm I he looks like Macho Man Randy Savage in my head. I don't know why. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> but like I don't know why. Okay, it's that scene like in Jurassic Park. It's like oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. It's just like over and over and over like a worm virus. Or and he's like oh no, oh no, you're reinstalling <laughs> Windows. Um, <laughs> Who? I, I don't even watch leads. wrestling and I know who Randy I Savage is. I only know I'm about him yeah. because of Epic Rap Battles of History. <laughs> uh, I know him from the Slim Jim commercials from the 2000s. I don't know why I'm picturing... I'm just picturing, like, sunglasses, the like the, the hat, the yep. like the beard. Yep. Macho Man picture, Randy like, Savage, baby. a tiny baby. little chop and pixel and it's, like, shooting him. Yeah. <laughs> like, out. No! No! <laughs> He's got... Okay. okay. The virus has been deleted. Whatever's right, been that's... tampering with my armor has now been gone. Shouldn't have any malfunctions like before. That's good. I don't know what any of those words meant, but it seems like you're in control, and that's all that matters. Yeah. yeah. You see, you're not going to murder anybody. Next to Kai. Yeah. You see, yeah. you see, Taki <laughs> say, "It looks like you're trying to end my life. Please don't. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't. Please don't. Please don't. Ah!" <laughs> <laughs> he starts like fading away. Terminated. I'll be watching Terminated. mobile form. Mm. Do you think that people will panic if I walk out in this? Oh, a hundred percent they will panic. You How are like, scary does he look? Well, you are also like the boogeyman of this entire town. You know what I mean? Mm. Like, like mm. this. You when people tell stories of like, you know, the evil Black Knight is this armor. So. <laughs> Um, I go over to this curtain and I pull it down and I'm like, we could put this curtain over you. You could just as be like a me, I guess that's like fine. a purple. No, we could cut eye holes on it. I'll take out my little like mm -hmm. fishing toolkit and just like throw a. <laughs> he's like a purple, like purple drapes are over him now. <laughs> Great! <laughs> oh my god, it's a purple ghost! <laughs> <laughs> just in time for the spooky season. It's a purple <laughs> giant ghost. <laughs> does the armor make you taller, or are you still roughly the I mean, same? I it is pretty big. Yeah, it does make him a bit taller. Yeah. Okay. And bulkier. Because it encompasses my entire body. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Shit, man. Okay. Uh, Malice gives you the side eye and says, You promise to take it off? Take it off? Well, I have to in order to actually function on the ship. I can't stay in this 24 7 Okay. So you'll take it off on the ship. <sighs> She's like hyperventilating a little bit. <laughs> I believe in Damien. Don't worry, Malice. He's a robot. Hmm. Yeah, that just means he doesn't feel emotion. No, Damien feels emotion. He feels sugar. Kai <laughs> 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 is like, wait, like emotions or taste? <laughs> the same thing, right? Like, yeah. Okay. Robots can't taste things. That doesn't make any sense. So you you guys walk out of the art gallery, and you see Easel behind his desk, and he he's he's painting, and he looks up, and he just sort of sadly shakes his head, and and Malice gives him a sort of sad look, and uh, they all they do is exchange like a a look, and then you guys can walk out. I can't see anything. I'm in a curtain. Yeah. <laughs> We, we cut little eye holes for yeah, you, yeah, but they're yeah. probably not that great. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, you now thank you see for what the... Ragnar sees on the mm -hmm. on the daily. There you go. <laughs> um, thank you for the uh, exhibit. It was nice. Uh, there's a lot of scorch marks in there, so sorry about that. It's okay. You do what you have to do. Um, and as you leave, you notice on the easel that he's painting, he's painting a picture of Malady, smiling and just like in her Aww. lab doing her own thing. And it just sort of has That's a little nice. date. That's um, nice. And you guys leave the. Uh, I guess you're just making your way back to the um, yeah. to the vessel. Yeah. I want to walk yeah. outside, and then Bell just drops down from one of the window sills. Like, oh, okay, that's where, <laughs> that's where you were the entire she's, time. Okay. She's, she has a uh, hundred belly in her hand that she just oh. found. Oh, wow, you just <laughs> found money on the like ground. A, like, a, like a hundred belly coin that was just like, just in the grass. Oh, well, thank you, Bell. Yeah. Oh, you, you say that and she doesn't give it to you. 
<laughs> you, <laughs> you, you go to hand. try and reach for it and she just puts it in her pocket. People are like found with lots of apostrophes. Found. There's found. a dude walking down the street like pockets. Yeah, she has a backpack. She has a crab pack. <laughs> a crab There's pack. a dude walking down the street that just is like, wait, I, I thought I had money for ice cream. Oh, yeah. shit. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, you guys make it back to the to your marine vessel. Um, and as you, I guess, are you dumping Malice in the brig? You currently have Rawdon Gansey also in the brig, I think? No, no, is he we still let unconscious? Him go. You let him, you let no, him no, go? We, we, get, we uh, sent him on a, sh uh, on a ship. To, you're yeah, right. Oh, yeah, Sorry, the you're ship. right. Yeah, Thanks, the Damien. Your, your, your yeah, brain is, yeah, yeah, yeah. We yeah. gave the guy so much money, too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you I gave, like, right. guy, like, <laughs> <laughs> a it was like, fortune. Okay. Absurd. We had but 20 million, and we gave him, like, a million in counterfeit money. Yes, yes. <laughs> and they, 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 <laughs> yeah, I was going to do their own cover story for them, but I forgot to do it. Um, yeah, Rod and Gamzee and that kid have been uh, going our way to the plate with Radishudi. So the only people on the ship as you get there are Quackington and um, uh, Goldie. And what, forgetting anyone? I don't think so. Um, no. I don't think we took any prisoners besides, yeah, we're fine. Yeah, we were yeah. going to, yeah. but then we yeah. had to let him go. Yeah, yeah. There's just uh, a random drunk in the brig for some reason. Quackington <laughs> threw on while we were gone. Like, uh... <laughs> okay. Uh, so right. you get back to the ship, and I guess you got to dump Malice into the uh, brig. Um, okay. Yeah, I mean, if that's what you're going to do. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Keep her in there. Yeah. Um, yeah. I, I know I was a lot of uh, problems, guys, so I'll, I'll volunteer to watch her so you don't have to. Mm. That's so noble of you, Kai. Thank you. Thank you. As, as long as you promise not to be swayed by her words. I'm not. No. <laughs> I have Belle. I'll have no. Belle with me. She'll keep me on the straight and narrow. No. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Tiger's like, another job done, guys. We're, we're the best at this shit. We're crazy <laughs> good Marines. Hey, man. The mission has been accomplished. I'm just happy for that. Hmm. Do you think we should. Minimal casualties. Think we Acceptable. Should... Incredible, right? Do you think we should call up Captain Bailey? Actually, yes, we should. All right. Um, uh, the ship does have a dented mushy, like all marine vessels should, have. Yeah, yeah all right. marine yeah, vessels yeah, yeah. would have that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I've probably been talking to her anyway to report our progress. Uh, I assume. I don't know if you you have the little earpiece thing. So, I think you just have one on the ship. I imagine. Yeah, just I mean, one sometimes on the they ship. carry well, I mean, like, like between missions, like, like hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Over, yeah, hey. You know? <laughs> 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 like three AM text messages. Like, yeah. how, hey, what are you up to, Captain Bailey? We're not doing much. We're just we're just going over no, to no, rest like, the sisters. I'm going over to this evil island. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Like, well, yeah. Okay. Into a clown. Yes. <laughs> she wakes up to like to befriend Gordon Games or sorry, Gordon Games. Yeah. 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 She okay. wakes up to like 15 text messages that are the entire arc, and it's just like, <laughs> yeah, oh, so, so, so now we're done. Detail. We're done. Yeah, <laughs> they're just actual like immaculate detail. They're two-hour <laughs> recordings, and they're just yeah. what these podcasts are. Yeah. It's just the <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. recordings. <laughs> okay, so you you pick up you. I guess you bring her on the Den Den Mushi, and yeah. she picks up and goes, Ah, Damien, you got something to report? How's the mission we going? We have successfully completed our mission. We not have only stopped, uh, I guess, the mafia the attacks here, but we've also managed to secure the uh, black armor with minimal casualties. Oh, that's perfect. That's perfect. Great. Um, well, the next thing we need to do is we need to set up a, a, a meeting point for you to be able to return the black armor back to um, the Marines. Um, uh, I see. We'll give you the coordinates, and uh, there, there, you, you, you'll come into contact with a marine vessel there, and um, it should be quick and simple. Hand over the armor. And one question. Yes. What are they gonna do with it? I don't know. He, um, it, it's Commodore Gus that's handling this, and he, he's a rank above me, and I, I don't really like to ask questions. I think they just want to keep it safe under lock and key. Um, I apologize. I have another question. That's okay. Ask away. <laughs> how did that? How did we lose the armor in the first place? That's strictly confidential. I'm afraid. Um, the Marines don't like to publicize their. Just between you and me, the Marines don't like to publicize their um, mistakes. But do you know it? I personally do not. But if anyone does, Commodore Gus would. Um, 
then I guess I'll have to ask him. If you want my advice, you'd probably be better not to. He probably won't give you a straight answer, and you don't want to anger the higher-ups. I mean, it's, it's, Understood. it is pretty unprofessional for you to be asking me these questions, but I consider us friends at this point, so I'm always happy, but... If you do this, you'll get a promotion. Understood. (laughs) (laughs) Okay. Uh, uh, (laughs) Um, It's not a man of a lot of words. Yes, yeah. yeah. (laughs) I said, I don't care about your history. I know there's probably a reason why you were demoted and exiled, but um, I haven't read the reports because I don't care. I think you're a good man, Damien, and I think you provide more benefit under the Marines as an active member than just stranded on some island somewhere. So, help me help you. Understood. Good. (laughs) And then, uh, she just says, good, well done, and give my compliments to the rest of the team. I will relay your message. Uh, and then like I they have like a little um <sighs> teching. Yes. Dendon Mushi expert. Yes. Um are there Dendon Mushi fax machines? Yes. Okay, so he there's the Dendon yeah. Mushi fax machine is gonna fax the uh, coordinates. Actually, ironically, the very first Dendon Mushi we see in the series is a has a fax machine yeah, attached to perfect, it. It's the perfect. One, one Nezumi uses to look at Luffy's face for his first one post. Perfect. So the yeah. little fax machine comes out and it has uh, the coordinates to, uh, for you guys to sail to the meeting point. Um, it should take a couple days. Okay. Um... So, do we level up from this? Yes, you do level up. You guys are now okay. level five. We're level five. Woo! Yes, five alive. Oh can we roll yeah. our hit point? Uh, <laughs> you sure can. I love doing it. Yeah, it. it's a uh, fun okay. time. All Everyone, right. roll your hit points. No, you get to re-roll a one. You get to re-roll a one. You get to re-roll. Yeah, you get to re-roll a one. Don't worry. Unless you get a four. Yeah, you rolled a D. No, 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 but why is yours a D four? Yeah, wait, wait, why is it a yeah, D4? What the fuck? F- fix it, or roll the D8 or whatever it, it actually is. Why does it always do and that? Alright. So, Bradley, that's uh, nine extra points to Bradley, ten okay. extra health points to Kai, which is incredible. <laughs> it's still yeah. It's still a four! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's that's the worst. Okay, so four hit points to Davian and six hit points to Yokan. And eight hit points to Bell. Good job. Jesus, <laughs> that's a beefy crab. Uh, yeah, she's up to thirty to now. Be. I'm at thirty. She, I'm, I'm at forty. She's at thirty. That's pretty even. Nice. Uh, and uh, seven for Tiger, which is All right, nice. Everyone just gets good hit points. You know, that's cool. yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's great. That's great. That's great. That's great. Sorry, <laughs> you're really having the durest thing again, David, where you just no, roll the, the worst thing. possible thing you could roll. Um, <sighs> it's fine. Support. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. I'm not supposed to be in the front lines. I, okay. It's what it is. It's what it is. Um, is there anything right. that you guys want to do? Uh, I assume you immediately set a course to the meter coordinates. Whilst you're sailing, you guys again have the opportunity to a talk to each other or talk to Quackington, Goldie, or Malice. If there's anything you guys want to do. I am well, going to we didn't hear okay. that conversation. So well, like, I assume, D- Damien, do you relay everything? Yeah, of course I relay yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, yeah, I'm gonna say like, yeah, we're, our new coordinates are here. Uh, we're gonna drop off the armor with a Commodore. What was his name? Commodore Gus. Yes. Commodore Gus. Mm-hmm. Uh, and that's gonna be the end of our mission. Apparently, we might even get promotions. Oh yeah. Promotion. <laughs> <laughs> Bailey also mentioned that congratulations all around. She considers us all friends. It's nice. Hey, does that mean me as 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 well? I yes. I, Yo, Connor, are you doing a dance? Yeah. <laughs> She's really happy. She's like dancing oh, in the okay. background. You That's are nice. part of our crew. You you are thusly. She considers you a friend. I think this genuinely might be the first girlfriend I've ever had that I haven't had to pay. 
Okay, well, I, I I'm Tiger gonna... look up disgust and then continue <laughs> dancing. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, <laughs> you've never called Tiger your friend, so. <laughs> and I, I said we could get there. At some yeah. point, right? I, I did. We could be comrades. I, a girl that that wants to be my friend. Do you guys? Do you think I have a chance? Do you, or do you think she's too old for me? I don't think she's that old. Wait, no, she's like in I, her twenties. I'm just right? walking past she's... these people and I'm just gonna go downstairs. <laughs> do you think? Do you think it's like unprofessional to date someone who's a higher rank than you? Do you think I have a chance, guys? Yokan. Uh, do you think I have it? Actually, you're scary. Never, uh, Bradley, you're oh, cool. Not here. <laughs> What's up, Tiger? Hey, Bradley. One thing, you, one thing you gotta know is it's the big difference between a girl that's your friend and a girlfriend. Ja, ja, ja. Uh, uh, well, how do I how do I make that transition? You know, listen. I've been. Uh, I, I read a whole bunch of books um, when I was a kid uh, that were like how you to. Can read? Um, I, I just looked at the pictures. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I just I, I looked at all the I, you know and it was like how how can you um you know rizz up a, a a girl ten tips to 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 guarantee that she falls in love with you and I always tried them and they never worked. Often people ja, would ja, ja. Slap there's me. no guarantees. You just gotta keep on shooting until you hit one, brother. <laughs> That's what I've been doing. But well, then you gotta try something new. I think your words per minute's a little bit too high, if you know what I mean. Ja, oh, ja, ja. Oh, oh, wait. You gotta I, calm it down a little bit. Uh, all right. Uh, well, what should I say? Like, let, let, get, give me. Ex let's say, for example, she comes up to me and she says, "Hi, Tiger. How are you doing?" What do I say? So, rather than freaking out and, you know, saying a bunch of things and getting super excited, just be chill. Just say, hey, how you doing? All right. Uh, next if time. You, you want to show okay. a little bit of interest hey. without showing a lot of interest, if that makes sense. Practice with Belle. So, Belle just comes over and just waves at, at, waves at Tiger like, hello. Tiger, like, slicks back his hair and he sort of gives a little wave and goes, hey, how you doing? Is that good, Bradley? Was that good? Did I do it? Did I do it well? Did I, get, did I do it? Did I get it? Did I get it good? <laughs> yeah, that's, that's a pretty good start, I'll say. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. I'll, I'll work on it. I'll work on it. Uh, yeah. Do you think I should start smoking? Like, no. <laughs> <laughs> all right. I just, you know, I always see people smoke and they're like really cool and. Uh, I know it's bad roll, for your health. Roll Tiger's charisma when he did that. When he did it to Bell? Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. He does have a minus well, one to his charisma. Oh, Three. God. So Three. she just... Yeah. She just scuttles off. <laughs> <laughs> she just turns around and is like, nope. <laughs> All right. Does anyone else want to talk to anyone else? Yeah, I want to talk to Malice. All right. You, you go to the brig. <laughs> Malice is just sitting there. Um, it looks like she's meditating, like breathing in and out. Well, hope you don't mind me coming in to talk to you. Okay. I'm not in the armor, obviously. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's good. You, <laughs> so, so you have ta you've well, you taken the off. armor. I've taken yeah. it off. It it's, is off. It seems you've taken the armor off, so you've kept your word. Or, or at yeah. least your, your teammates did. I could... It shows a... A molecule of trust. If I want some trust, then you better show some back to me. I need some answers from you. <sighs> I don't see no. I don't see any harm. What do you want to know? How did you steal this armor in the first place? We stole it from the auction. I'm not sure how it ended up there, but once we heard the the armor was on sale at the auction. We managed to um, uh, organize. We took out all of the guards. We we broke into the back and we 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 lugged it away. It was actually surprisingly easy. I don't think they realized how much value that armor really had. So you have no information how it came to that auction? No, not at all. Uh, we thought See. it was before that auction. We really thought, yeah, it was gone forever. Really. <laughs> just say under my breath, damn. Damn. <laughs> How did... I have another question, then. Yes. How did you know it was me who made it? She looks down. I managed to get my hands on some reports. Um, they, uh... Your... Your documents, your reason for... Your, your exile... Um, 
I think it was a... There was a marine captain who was stationed in Tarako um, when I was growing up there um, with my sister. Uh, he was close friends with... Uh, uh, Jeppard, I think, was was his name. God damn it, Jeppard. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I think this was a uh, Captain Marrow. And at the time, uh, Captain Jeppard, they used to hang out a lot. And uh, at the time, I hated the Marines. And I just wanted to like. I used to do minor acts of petty vandalism against them. Used to rob their stuff. Steal their things, you know, that sort of thing. You know, young child stuff. And one day I broke into their office and I found that those documents. Your face, front and center. The details of the mission. It seems like Jeppard enjoyed showing it off to people. I see. Gloating about your downfall, ironically. Um. Uh. It is what it is. <laughs> it is yeah. what it is. It is. <laughs> Understood. Look, I don't have any way to guarantee what's going to happen to you. But I can at least leave their names out of the reports. That much I can promise you. Good. Just say it was just me. Leave, leave my sister's names out of it. They were just roped into all of this. Leave Easel out of this and leave... Considering you were their leader, that's something I can ease the ripple. Good. Thank you. You can kill me if you want. That's not my decision. As I walk out. <laughs> as I walk. Single tear rolls down her cheek as she <laughs> looks out. All right. Anything? Anything else? Anyone wants to talk to before we reach to the meeting point? Um, yeah, I just want to, uh, like, if I'm guarding Malice for the most part, like, at night, I'm mm -hmm. just gonna, like, uh, pull a chair up, and I just want to ask her, like, hey... This is, like, a separate um, conversation. Yeah, this is a separate conversation. Probably after the Damien conversation. Yeah, probably after the... Like, later that evening. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm just like, listen, uh, I know you were really upset earlier when you said most of this, but I just want to, like, can uh, you tell me your story about what happened? And you don't have to go through the whole thing, but, like, just understand, like, she calmly and concisely tells me mm -hmm. the story of what happened yeah you know yeah I, I i mean yeah and she'll 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 go over it i don't know if there's anything that you don't know at this point if you want me to reiterate it's joe no, it's just like kai yeah. being willing to like listen. i'm gonna listen to you and yeah. what your story is and try to like make decisions on his own like my, okay my parents were part of a volunteer militia that served mm. um part of a, a rebellion prince jasper wanted to rise up against his corrupt f father um, King Malachite of the Tarako Kingdom. Uh, he he had been awful, awful man doing terrible things to civilians. He was even. Why did the Marines do nothing about that? Well, he was obeying the laws of the Marines. That's the thing, right? He was allowed to do whatever he wanted in his own kingdom because he was the king. As That's long stupid. as he, exactly. That's my point. Ah, yeah. Law yeah. doesn't always correlate with with justice. Kai and. is being radicalized throughout this conversation. <laughs> Kai, <laughs> Kai doesn't know shit about how world politics work, and now he's learning it from Malice's perspective. Mm -hmm. He's going to, like, become a revolutionary after this shit. All right, but yeah. Jasper said okay. it, enough was enough. And, uh, and the final straw was his younger sister, baby sister. Um, she, I, w I, was, I was but a baby at this time as well. Hmm. But... Uh, I, I guess. Well, I, I wait. I've got to make sure my timelines are correct. No, you're um, fine. Uh, in terms of ages, but um, so this is what twenty years ago. Yeah, ish. So Pearl, Pearl would, have would, been, would have actually been like, like a child. She would have been like five or six. Yeah, she would have yeah, been. Yeah. Well, she would have been like seven, eight, nine at that age. So okay, yeah. Her yeah. Younger sister um, was being uh, manipulated and forced to be a, a weapon of mass destruction herself. She was force-fed a devil fruit, and uh, and this was horrible. all kept very hush hush. And Jasper found out about it, told us about it, well, told my parents about it, and we wanted to. F they wanted to fight for a better life, and they said it was fine. Like they said, the worst thing that would happen is they would be arrested, 
it was a peaceful protest. They only fought back because mm. the Marines ended up using violence. Uh, and after that, I was orphaned and I was provided no support by the Marines. Sins of the Father. And I... And I... And eventually, as I grew into my teenage years, um, me and a, a lot of other orphaned um, girls from different parts of the world, all wronged by the Marines or wronged by pirates or wronged by whoever in different ways, um, uh, our adoptive mother took us all in and raised us. And because we had no support from the world government or all the Marines at this point, we had to do whatever we could to survive. And that involved crime and stealing. And that's why uh, yeah. I am here where I am today. Oh, thank you so much for telling me that story. I have a lot to think about. I come from just a humble little fishing village in the middle of nowhere. I don't know much about world governments and stuff, but... Hmm. Oh, man, this does not... <laughs> I don't know. <clears throat> Kai's like, I don't know how to process all this shit. Like, you know, it's like, Marines are supposed to be good guys. It's like, what? Huh? <laughs> Corrupt kings and shit? Like, he doesn't know about that stuff. It's like... <sighs> He's dead, though, right? Malachi, yeah. Oh, okay, good. That's yeah. a good thing. All right, cool. Uh, there was a group of pirates I heard that killed him years later. Oh my god, um, the pirates killed him? Jesus! Yeah. <laughs> the story's getting more complicated. <laughs> uh. And now Jasper's the king, and one day I hope to return there. Uh, I don't think he'll ever recognize me, but it would be nice to yeah. say, say hello. Huh. Well, I'd say I hope you get a fair judge and process, but I'm not, I don't exactly sure. It's we okay. We're talking about this, this prison place called Impel Down. It does not sound fun. <laughs> uh, as long yeah. as my sisters are safe, and as long as the people of Acrylic City are safe, then I'm you're happy. You're a good sister. And I think you're a good man, Kai. Thank you. All right. Okay. So All right. Just, yeah, I'm just going to listen to her story, and that was it. Yeah. There we go. All right, so we, we, we will then, I guess, if nobody else wants to talk to anyone else. I'm, we, I'm literally just staring at my armor the entire yeah, time. Yeah, you're like, I, I, I'm, I'm just what a beauty. <laughs> the like, only thing I'm going to say is just like, uh, you know, ever since I ate that devil fruit, I've been so tired. I'm going to go take a nap. And I'm going <laughs> to climb up to the, <laughs> the, 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 the crow's nest. The, the crow's <laughs> nest and just nap up there. Do you turn into a cat? I'm going to guess cat while I'm asleep. I just randomly transform into a cat. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Like without without me doing it on purpose. Yeah, cat. Huh. All right. Cat well, out. She's not turning Cats into a giant monster a and killing everyone. So I mm -hmm. guess that's good. Yeah. Huh. Okay. Giant monster. Yeah, you're just a, a giant little, were cat little in the middle of the night. <laughs> <laughs> okay. After a couple of days, you guys spot a giant marine vessel in the in the distance. Um, and it, it's a, it, you know, it, it's a marine vessel, but it has a slightly different design. It has, on the end of its masts, it has giant sort of mushroom caps um, instead of the crow's nests. And it's painted in the typical marine colors, but it has a couple, like, spots on it as well. Okay. Um, and the marine vessel pulls up next to, you, to your, your ship and anchors. Um, and I assume that you do the same. Um, I'm yeah, not driving gonna, it. I'm going to pull up to it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then the, he, it lowers down, I guess, the plank to connect the two ships. And you see this giant man with his marine jacket. He has a giant, what looks like a mushroom cap on. Um, big, strong hmm. features. Uh, giant just giant hands he's 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 wearing like big white and red gloves uh he's got a huge smile of, okay. of discolored teeth and he he goes all right then sounds like you guys got a little gift for me um right you must be welcome yeah. aboard <laughs> yes you're kind of saluting oh right yeah 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 yeah, yeah. 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 everyone's gonna salute <laughs> everyone's gonna yeah, we'll, we'll good salute, obviously a little bit late right. but Good. Uh, right, where's this armor then? In uh, Damien's just, room. 
Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, am I not out there? <laughs> no, 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 no. No, you David's are. I just say it David's first. Out there. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'll take you to it. Here, follow me, Commander. Or sorry, what is it? Commodore. Is he, Commodore. Yeah. Commodore. Commodore. Yeah. Okay. The rank above Captain. Okay. okay. Um, uh, all right. He 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 brings a couple of men with him, and he boards your ship, and you lead him to the room which has the armor in it. And he yeah. he looks over. So I see. This is the beauty, huh? Yeah, that's that's my creation. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's a lovely piece of work. I thought Jep had made it though. Why do you th say Jep had made it? Yeah, that's just what he says. Anyway, don't worry. I'll keep it safe and sound. Were and you the one in charge of protecting it last time? I nah, not. that person's been dealt with and fired. You don't have to worry. All right. And he grabs the armor and he lifts it with, with oh, intense shit. strength. Oh, and he just puts okay. it over his shoulder like a fireman carry. Uh -huh. Is this guy like white beard size? Like, um, is he, he is. Huge? He's decently big. I'd say maybe he's like eight. He's like eight nine feet. Like he's big. Um, but I not mean, white by beard. One Piece standards, yeah, that's yeah. not very big though. Okay, but he he's definitely bigger than all you. Um, okay, all right. Uh, he puts it over his shoulder. Um, right, it's pretty heavy, isn't it? Yeah, it was designed to uh, repel pirates of any capacity. Right. Well, we're gonna put that to the test, aren't we? He like pats Such things it. on fire. Yeah. <laughs> With all due respect, if you want someone to test it, why not use me? I am the creator. Yeah. Sorry, mate. I don't believe you. You are. Uh, what are you? Like a a private seaman? Nah. No way. Someone like you. Oh made no, something no, like this. sir. Giant mushroom man. You don't understand. Damien is the creator of the armor. Like he is. He deserves to be. Come on now. It's his stuff. Very he can tell funny. you anything you want about Listen, it. Listen, I got the pattern straight from Jeopard. We we know it's, it's Jeopard's armor. We're we're Jamie, taking it back. Come on, don't don't let him don't let him take the the credit for this. You can tell him anything you want. How many screws are in that armor? Damien can tell you right here, right now. He, he leans down yeah, toward he leads down towards you, Kai, and goes, "Yeah, you're Jiro's nephew, aren't you? You, you know talk, my uncle? yeah. You talk. I work with him. You talk. Oh, cool. How's he been? Shut up." <laughs> You talk way too much for a lowly seaman. You don't talk this way to a commanding officer. I could have you reprimanded. I could do a lot worse to you. I could squish you like a bug right now, and nobody would fucking care. Okay? That's not... You, you really shouldn't be talking like that. Says who? And he, like, you, his, his breath fucking stinks of like... <laughs> oh, God. His breath stinks of like spores and like... Uh, like <laughs> rotten mushrooms. Kai, make sure you salute your superior officer. Yeah. That, he says that to you, Kai. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. I look at you guys and like, like, I'm just gonna like elbow Kai in the side really hard. All right. <sighs> That's good. I give That's it. It's kind of half-assed, though. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> right. Well, it was fun seeing you a lot. I'm heading back to the Grand Line. And he, he, he just he walks out and he gets back on his ship. Send my regards to Captain Bailey. Understood. <laughs> fun guy, 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 guy. And he gets back onto the uh, ship, and he jumps the armor down. And onboards the thing, and his ship starts to sail away into the distance. Guy was an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> like, God, that's not how a marine. He's a freaking commodore. That's not how they should act to us. Not cool, that's man. That's not how you should act to your superior officers too. What? Okay, <laughs> what? So because of some bullshit fucking hierarchy, if he he could just be a dick to me, and I have to take it. <laughs> well, you gotta treat him with respect. You treat Why? Him with he didn't exhibit any! <laughs> you don't talk casually to your superior officers. I imagine that guy probably exacted a lot of justice in his day. I'm just saying, if that, if that guy knows my uncle, my uncle didn't act like that at all, man. 
Yeah. The problem is, we need people with strength like him in order to take on these pirates who are equally, if not even more strong. Uh, Kai, uh, I mean, Tiger is in the corner and you can see there's this wet stain around his uh. marine <laughs> trousers. Tiger! <laughs> Yeah, right. John, John, John. Looks like he was trying to do some fish man karate. <laughs> <laughs> He's just, oh, Tiger. And that's the end of the episode. No, it's not the end. It's like, we're really like, oh, Tiger. <laughs> really halfway through. Um, Rustage, would you al have allowed me to install a tracker on the, my arm? <laughs> After the fact. Um, oh, oh, gosh. Um, I, I Listen, you reprogrammed it now, so yes, you could have installed a yeah. tracker, so... Not um, that I would do anything. I just want to know where it is. Yeah. <laughs> like, like Damien, didn't that yeah. piss you off? Like, he like literally told you to your face that you're not the creator, and you just took it. Just because he states in factual information does not mean that I can get angry at him. <laughs> we came from very <laughs> different upbringings. <laughs> <laughs> so if he punched me in the face, like I'm supposed to just take it and just. Like, you know, well, he's a superior officer, so he punched me. It's fine. Damon's like, really well, like, you were mouthing off. If he did to something him. to upset the natural hierarchy, then maybe you deserve that punch. Mm. <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay. Oh, wow. All right. Okay. Holy moly. All oh, the pieces are starting. The, the the pieces are falling into place for Kai here. We, we really right. have two sides of the, like, <laughs> the, the spectrum of Marines. Um,. You gotta, we you gotta realize, Kai, in all in all facets of life, people that are strong with power, a lot of them end up being assholes. As long I'm as you can break the that. law, you still have to obey the hierarchy. It's the same thing with pirates and with fishmen and with everything, you know. So it's just the strong uh, those, guys. Those are the strongest are, are on top, huh? Okay. Well, by that we logic, by that logic, how about I get strong, or we all get strong, and we change the Marines? How does that logic work? Exactly. Then let's do that. All right, that damn straight. Yeah, <laughs> let's fucking I mean, do it then. Yeah. There would be no reason to fight a superior officer unless they're breaking the law, you know? Yeah. You see, Kai, well, this is why. If they're just being an asshole, you can't do nothing. That's this exactly is why. my plan right now. I need to get promoted. I need to find out where my uh, armor is being held. And I need to take control of it once again. And now that I know Jeopard's behind most of this, I'll get behind it. I'll find mm. out where he is. Mm-hmm. Uh the mighty Jefford. Okay, so um, after a few hours of being on the ship, um, the Denden Mushi rings again. Okay. I don't know. That's the. I don't know what, what fucking noise does the ringing make. I feel like I oh, keep. Oh, forgetting. oh, I got this. I got you got this. It, you got, got it. You got it. Oh yes, it's iconic. Why did I? How could I forget that? Sorry, Rustage. Hello. I've just got reports that you've um, handed over the armor to, to Gus. So, good job, Damien. I know it must have been difficult for you. I see. So um, you know as much as... as okay. I, I won't say anything, actually. Yeah. Understood. Right. Um, I, this is... um. I've got one little small mission for you guys to, to, to do before you return back to base, if that's okay. Um, we've, um, we've been trying to reoccupy all of the, uh, the, um, areas that the Seven Sisters used to control before, um, you know, before you managed to take them down over the last couple of days whilst you guys have been sailing. And, uh, there's this one place in particular that we can't really, the populace is rowdy and we want to be able to gain their loyalty and show them that Marines are good guys. They're talking about, and trust me, I know this sounds silly. I know this sounds silly, but they're terrified out of their minds that apparently there's this ghost that's like terrorizing the town. Um, and it's en route back to, um, uh, to, to, at Kibbleton, uh, to the Ballywood Kingdom. It's, it's en route back to the Ballywood Kingdom. So if you're able to check it out, um, that would be great. Um, Ghost. Interesting. If that is my mission, I will carry it out. Great. Wait, what did she say? Damien, I heard ghost. What? Is it a... what? 
Uh, I'll just like put a finger up. Is that all the report? <laughs> yeah. Um, that's all the report. And again, congratulations, Ensign Damien. Ensign. Oh, you're an ensign now. That's a fancy name. Ensign, sorry. Oh, you're so close to me, Wally. Yeah, Kai's <laughs> <Yeah, close to laughs> just like, <laughs> he's got his ear to the, um... Anything. Anyway, apparently there's a ghost coming to the Bollywood Kingdom. Our mission, temporary as it may be, is to check out make sure nothing's wrong over there. We just saved the kingdom. Let's make sure it stays safe. Mm -hmm, Wait, mm -hmm. holy shit, are, are ghosts real? I was fucking around with the fisherman thing. There's, the, there's an actual ghost? <laughs> it is illogical. Hey yeah, guys, I, don't think <laughs> I, cha I changed my trousers, I changed my pants. Um, uh, what are you guys talking about? Tiger yeah, or a ghost reel? GHOST! Ah! <laughs> <It's> just <laughs> Oh no, I've got to change another pair of trousers! <laughs> Go to <laughs> Alright, he leaves, he comes back in. Alright guys, I've changed trousers, my third pair. I've only packed three pairs. So, uh, anyway. There's a washing machine on board, maybe, hopefully. Uh, I don't know. What, what are we talking about again? Apparently in Bollywood Kingdom may be under attack by some sort of entity that is said to be a ghost. A ghost? Not really. Ah! Oh, <laughs> gosh! Oh, Tiger, buddy. Uh, I'm gonna have to if borrow some. this up, he's gonna be a piss mad karate master. <laughs> I'm not giving you my pants. I'm sorry. We're not under undercover anymore, right? We're officially um, no. back, in, back in Marines now. Again. Back Let's in Marines. And just the guy dressed it's, it's like a, ourselves. It's an island, like, on the way to the Bollywood Kingdom. Like, yeah. It's, yeah. It's not the Bollywood Kingdom itself. Oh, um, island. Okay. Yeah, 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 right. island. Okay. I've been learning a lot about the world recently on top of governments and politics. And ghosts are real? Okay. This is, I'm learning so much, Wait. you know? Can pirates be ghosts? Pirate ghost ghosts? Pirates. Ghost pirates? Mm. Oh god. Ooh. All those people. <laughs> Happy <laughs> Halloween, everyone. All right. Hold, up. <laughs> Hold up. Hold up. Okay. It is a it is a myth, obviously, that dogs and cats can sense paranormal things. Yeah. So, yes, it so is. you're saying you yeah. want us to hold you up out of, in front of the ship? Like some sort Maybe of radar. I'm saying that if I see a ghost, you guys are gonna know about it. Yeah. Yeah, and if it's right. a ghost pirate. <laughs> okay. Okay. It's about a day's travel away, so we, we, we'll, we'll cut ahead if you guys are going to the island, to you guys docking onto the island in your marine vessel, full marine uniform. Right? Well, no, no undercover <laughs> shit going on here. Yeah. yeah. Um, uh, thank fucking God. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you, you dock onto the island, and you, you, you get off, and... It's it's a small like city on the island. Um, it's quite quaint. Um, it looks relatively poor. Like it's it's not the you know the craziest most well off town. I mean, you could think something like um, Orange Town from from a oh okay yeah okay. Yeah. yeah yeah something to nice. that level. Um, so you you get onto the docks again as there is in every single island there's a bunch of people fishing on the uh on the coast <laughs> um but they're fishing whilst looking around kind of scared like um, i hold up yokon and then just use her as, as like a radar <laughs> <laughs> i will be in cat form you just kind of hold me like a gun <laughs> <laughs> all, right. all right guy i think this is your expertise go ask them yeah some i got it a special Although, fisherman handshake i'm just gonna stay in cat form for now just uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. on alert That's for right. any paranormal entities okay you're in cat form so you wait you're gonna go talk to the fisherman wait i'll just sit on damien's shoulder for now How about okay that? <laughs> That's fine. Okay, Kai, you go out to the fisherman. All right, uh, the special fish fisherman handshake. Oi, bro, you are, you're a fellow fisherman? Damn straight I am. Hey, you want to get off this island? Dudes, there's a, there's a, apparently there's a ghost. I don't know anything about it. I'm staying by here. You listen, I'm, I'm terrified. Um, hey, you got a fish, you got a fish, no matter what. I understand that much, but is it a real ghost? And what kind of ghost, if it is real, are we talking about I've, here? I've heard of dead bodies showing up. Um, I, I, like I don't know the information. Shore? No, 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 just like in town, occasionally oh, shit. there will be like a dead body just on the ground, right? Um, I, I don't know much. I mean, I'm trying to stay as far away as... If, if you want to know more, I, I, you, you've got to go into town and... Um, okay. Uh, sorry, mate. No, it's okay. It's understandable. I'm just... We're the Marines. We're here to help. Uh, if it's just a ghost or maybe... Maybe a bear or something killing people. I don't know, but we'll take care of it. Oh, don't worry. That's oh. why we're we're here to help, man. I hug him. Oh, 
I haven't been hugged in years. It's okay. Thanks, dude. It's all right. It's okay. Uh, I know you've been maybe what, going through Hey, some what's stuff your name, lately. bro? What's your name? I'm I'll Kai. I'll remember you. I'll remember you. Thanks. I'll remember you. All right. By the this way, uh, who's the um, who's the mayor of the town? I'm just gonna ask. Uh, we we don't really know at the moment. So oh, we here's, a, here's is the mayor dead? Well, no, uh, you're with the Marines, right? So I, well, I yeah, feel absolutely. Safe. Yeah, justice. Yeah. So um, <laughs> uh, there was a there was a girl called Ninny who used to like foresee uh, things in this town, yeah, yeah, yeah. but she would yeah. she would strong arm us. She would, she, would, she you know she'd take money taxes were high we haven't had a mayor in ages wow. since they were in control but she hasn't been here for a few days and then this ghost problem arrived and i don't know i don't know mm. the details man okay well Listen. thank you i appreciate that what's your name my name's salt salt that's i like that name it's high in sodium wait thank you <laughs> so <laughs> 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 uh, my brother's a doctor um okay yeah, um, I'm just a fisherman. Yeah, of course, but it's a noble profession. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. <laughs> um, Bradley sneaks up behind them and goes, "Boo!" Oh shit! Ah! <laughs> 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 I have a theory. I think it's just someone who's really stealthy running around. I once convinced my buddy at the uh, back at the dorm that I was a ghost for a whole weekend. <laughs> 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 yeah, what if it's just a guy that's just really stealthy like you, Bradley? Yeah. Like I said, I, I convinced him that the dorm was haunted. <laughs> if you can't see me, you, there's always a reasonable explanation. You do disappear a lot. Okay. I'm glad you get it, Brad. Maybe I'm part ghost. <laughs> <laughs> uh, logical. I'll have to test that. Uh, all right. Do you guys want to venture into the town? I guess we're going in the town. Yeah. 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 There's there. Uh, Yokon, did, did you hear about the ninny thing? Oh, hey. Yokon, did you hear about the ninny thing? Yeah, my ears perked up. Uh -huh. And yeah. then, as soon as they started talking about her crime, my ears fell back down. Oh, oh. okay. Oh. Apparently, she was, I guess, the one in charge here, but she wasn't very nice, which was weird because she was very nice when we fought her. <laughs> yeah, I'm something. Ain't you, right. Most pirates are not nice. They try to trick you with their lies. I wish we could have taken her in. We could fix her. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see, talking about fixing people too. I don't know about that. Huh? It's just weird mm -hmm. verbiage. Okay. So there, this town has like a tavern. It has a general store. It has a blacksmith. It has a like a little fountain in the center of the town. It has everything you think a quaint town would have. Uh, where would you guys like to go? Well, we need to find out the origin of most of these attacks. Mm-hmm. Um, I forgot to ask Salt, but I asked him about where the dead body was. Could yeah. he just be specific? Like, it was in front of the bank or well, something? No, he, like he doesn't know anything about where the dead bodies oh, were. Okay. He just knows there were dead bodies. But he's been All keeping right, sure. away from the action. Okay, I'm fair sure point. there's some sort of news, some paper yeah. or something around here that yeah. we can learn of where some basic information. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, where do you want to go to find newspapers then? I, I guess the center of town where there'd be like town criers and other things like yeah. that typically. Yeah, yeah. You, you, you walk into the center of town, uh, and there's nobody outside at the moment because they're all wow, terrified. And uh, the you see, there's like a mild fog in the. Um, oh, what time of day is this? Um. Oh gosh, like midday. Oh, okay. So this looks like still creepy. Midday, uh, yeah, mid yeah, yeah. That midday fog rolling but like, in. Yeah, there's <laughs> a midday fog rolling in. Um. That's highly unusual. Yeah. Usually, that's only in the morning. And um. You know, the sun, you can't really see behind the clouds, so everything's slightly mm. dark and dreary. Okay. Um, and there's a, a newspaper flutters through the wind, and it it it, it sort of hits Damien in the face. <laughs> oh, okay. Damien just, I try to grab yeah. it. <laughs> it gets in my face. Uh, just yeah. as effective. And it, you, so <laughs> it says, local old woman horrified as she finds dead body on doorstep. Jeez. Ghost yeah. strikes again. On a doorstep. Interesting. Does it say who the person was? Yeah, any, and in the smaller words? text it says, uh, local old lady Margaret um, was just minding her day-to-day -day business, drinking her tea and and reading the... And it, was, it says the name of the paper. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, and... Um, until she was met with a horrific surprise when she opened her front door to go for her morning walk and what lay before her but another corpse another corpse uh, 
and another victim of the horrific ghost that haunts the streets. Well, sounds like we just need to walk these streets and we'll eventually uh, find out what's going they're, on here. They're really, re like, just, like, kneeling into the ghost thing. Like, they're just, like, it's, like, not even any other ideas. It's just, no, there's mm -hmm. just a ghost murdering people. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's... Like Attention, any... ghost! We are the Marines! <laughs> Do you yell that out loud? Yes! <laughs> Alright, you, you hear a voice go, You guys here to hunt ghosts too, huh? Shit! <laughs> where, where direction <laughs> is that coming and, from? And a man steps out. He's got, like, <laughs> circular glasses that shine over, a bit curly hair, uh, a mustache, and he's smoking a cigarette. And he's in quite a fancy get-up. And he is a... Just emerges from the fog? Yeah, he emerges from the fog, and he's got a giant okay. pack and this, like, weapon on his back. And he blows out some smoke. Y yes, we're here to hunt the ghost. <sighs> Good. W what are you, strange man? I could use some help. The name's Captain Spook, the infamous ghost hunter. I've been drawn okay. to this island. Because I've heard tales of a specter. Can I, like, jump down behind me <laughs> and just, like, transform back into myself and just, like, tower over me <laughs> holy in the darkness? Mm -hmm. Interesting. You guys are with the Marines, huh? Uh, yeah. We are the Marines. Mm. Then you don't have to worry. I've got this under control. You can go back and deal with actual crimes and pirates. Once this ghost Sorry. is dead, uh, Captain Spook will deal with it. Reassuring. But what if it's a ghost pirate? But <laughs> yeah, ghost pirates would fall under our ourselves. jurisdiction. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, David. What did you say? We won't interfere with bounty hunters. But if you want, like, uh, we we can't just back down because you said so. We're the Marines. We're here to protect the people. This is also our mission. Yeah. He likes. And they said to the people here did, post. They said the people didn't like the Marines here, so we gotta put the we gotta put the the faith in the Marines back in these people. He like sizes you up. You guys, I don't know if you guys have the, the guts to go up against a ghost, but prove me wrong, I guess. You guys got any information? Um, old lady. We should go talk to her then, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Might as well get some info out of this old lady. Mm. <sighs> you know what she okay. does? Uh, check I look the at paper, the newspaper. It says, does, yeah, it, says, okay, it has a full address. <laughs> wow. Full address okay. There. <laughs> that, it's it's yeah. like if you want to pay her a visit to like wish her well. Yeah. Um, yeah fair enough. All right, sure. Let's go pay a visit to old lady Margaret. Okay. She may have some more info. I'm going to transform back into a cat before we leave. Yeah. Mm. Old ladies love cats. That's good thinking. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so you walk up to her house and you knock on the door. Do you say anything as you knock on the door? Mm. Uh, obviously, I was like, hello. Oh, is this the address of, and I'll say her name. Margaret, Margaret. Here. Margaret. You hear a voice from the other side that goes, oh, it's, if you're a ghost, please stay away. You're in luck. We're not ghosts. Are you sure? I'm a fisherman. <laughs> That's... We're the Marines. We're here to take care of the, this ghost problem. The Marines? Thank God. She walks it over and opens the door slowly. And she's a small little old woman. Oh, my husband used to love the Marines. Come on in. Would you like some tea? Um, a cake? I, I, I made a Battenberg the other day. It's still good, I promise. It's, it's better than the one from the local store. Um, I can make tea for everybody. Um, uh, do we have enough seats? Um, there's quite a lot of you. You have quite long arms. Um, I don't know if you'll be able to, to rest. Come, come on in. It, it must be so I cold am a cat. out there. <laughs> you have, you, have you transformed into a cat again? Yeah, yeah, I said before, before oh, yeah, yeah, we yeah. leave, yeah. I'm going to be... So right, what yeah. I'm going to do is I'm just going to jump off Damien's shoulder and run into her house, and I'm just going to, oh. like, look around for anything that might be relevant. Mm. Yeah, it's just the harmless little house of an old lady. Uh, I, the only thing you notice is, like, maybe there's, like, a picture frame on the wall of this old lady and her husband, who, this old man, Nick. Rustage, and, yes. um, this house, is there, um, like, outside, is there, like, basement windows or anything on there's the no lower basement. ground? There's no basement. There's no basement. There's no, no okay, basement. Okay, that's fine. Um, All right. Okay. You, you, if I don't notice anything, I'll just run, walk back into the main mm -hmm. room. Yeah, come okay. on, come on in. Come on in. Okay. Fair uh, enough. I'll lead the way. Okay. <laughs> you guys, I guess, will sit down. Um, 
I like probably break her chair if I sit down, so I'll stand. <laughs> <laughs> so, just awkwardly. And she serves you little plates with slices of cake. Oh, that's um, lovely. Uh, so, is it carrot cake? It's it's Battenberg. I don't know what that is. I'm not I don't know what it is either. Oh, Google it. Google it. I tell <laughs> <laughs> it. Oh my god. It's Battleberg. Okay. Battenberg. Battenberg. You guys have never had Bat Battenberg, Battenberg before. Battenberg cake. Okay, let's see this. Battenberg shit. cake. It's like oh, a sponge okay. cake oh, with marzipan okay, so around it. I've I've seen that. Okay, marzipan. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. As long as it's got sugar in it, I can break it down. That looks good. Yeah. <laughs> as long as there's no fruits in it, I'm Ooh. fine. Yeah. Yeah. You know, you guys are the first visitors I've had in quite a long time. My son used to visit, but she he doesn't anymore. Um, oh, it's okay. You remind me of my grandma. She has dementia. Oh, that's sad to hear. I hope she's doing oh, okay. I don't really know. It's been a while since I've been back. Dementia is so, really difficult to deal with. We my, have questions. Like <laughs> 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 that. Uh, my, look, uh, did you know the victim uh, in this newspaper? Why did she show up at your doorstep? I don't know. I just opened my door and there was a dead body and it, it frightened the living daylights out of me. I'm telling you, I, gosh, I'm getting faint just thinking about it now. Oh. Was it a man? Was it a woman? Who was it? Oh. It, it it was a it was a young man a young fella I don't know I think he worked at the local store or something. Um, okay. He, he had a habit of going for long walks. I mean, this is why I don't go for walks anymore. I used to visit my my husband down at the graveyard, and I I haven't been in in a very long time, because um. Because I'm just I'm so frightened. You see. Hmm. Uh, Do you know where he he used to go for walks? I'd, he'd go all around the farm. Um, he'd occasionally visit the graveyard as well. Um, I'd see him out there sometimes when I was visiting my the, my husband's grave uh, not long after we buried him. Um, uh, the, the the guy with the... <laughs> Captain Spook's like, cut the shit, old woman. We want information, and we want it faster than this. Well, I don't give a shit about your fucking husband. Hey, right. I smack him upside the head. You be nice to an old lady. Hey, 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 we're here to get rid of a ghost. Did you see a ghost or not? Oh, I, I can't say I saw a ghost, but it must have been a ghost. Like, nobody in this town would, would kill anybody. Deary me, to think. Everyone here is so lovely and nice. You guys have pirates around here? Oh, the cat speaks. I, I think the only pirate is that 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 horrible lady, N Ninny. She she always used to um, I, I, I always used to tell her I didn't have enough money to pay her what what she 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 wanted, and the, the extortionate about it. I I need to have get the ingredients to make my Battenbergs. Um, there's less people to eat them nowadays, but they they remind me of my family when I and and you know I'm a poor old lady. I did. I, don't, don't, I don't worry. You did gave us more than enough information that we needed. I thank you for your cooperation. That's All right. A, uh, well, um, thank you very much. If you could deal with this horrible ghost situation, I can I'll finally be able to... Uh, I, I grab her hands, her probably very clammy old lady hands, and just like, we'll take care of this, Margaret. Don't worry about it. Thank you. Thank you, young man. Um, okay. But before you go, can you yes. answer me something? Um, sure. I, I, it might be my eyesight. I, I'm not quite sure, but uh, does that fish have legs? Oh, Are you talking about me? <laughs> oh, God, it, was, it, it spoke. It spoke. Uh, I thought it was like uh, I, I, what? I, do you just? Sorry, I, I'm a, uh, you, you've never seen a fish man before. I don't really even know what that is. I, sorry, my you. Yeah. Where people that live underwater. Underwater, you say? Yes. Do you have coffee shops down there? Do we have you coffee do. shops down there? You do. We do have coffee <laughs> shops do. down there. Thank yeah. you. Second. Oh, well, um, how do you breathe? Like the same well, way fish get. Uh, fish they have gills. Yeah. yeah. They have gills. So uh, I do have I do have lungs for breathing outside of water, but I have gills for inside water. I'm half man, half fish. Oh, Kinda. dearie, this all is fish all, man. all too complicated for me. I'm sorry. Back in my day, we just had we just had people. 
We just had people. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, it's okay. This is a good It's okay. Don't need to worry. You've been, you've been very nice. I'm just a, a humble this Marine. This is starting to sound like Kieran my grandmother duty. again. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Let's get going. That's that's <laughs> why we wanted to get out of here. No, I, I, I'm not, yeah, I'm not, I'm not against we'll it. Care of it. I, I, I think it's great. I just. I, I'm, it's in okay. My old just age, make it's your difficult. cakes and your coffee and your tea, and then we'll take care of the mean old ghost, okay? Yeah. Uh, Okay. I sit up still as a cat and salute her. <laughs> Don't worry, ma'am. We got this. And then I prance. I will up. salute the old <laughs> lady. <laughs> 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 like, did you speak I mean, her she, as a she cat? Ignored the, she ignored this, uh, me speaking as a cat the first time. Didn't even <laughs> yeah. phase her. So, yeah. like, so you're saluting as a cat? Yeah, yeah. just like sitting on my hind legs and just with the just with the so paw guys, and just don't, walk out. You might you might call me Barmy, but I swear that that cat just saluted at me. Oh, she's Yokon. And I just walk out with no more yeah. information given. That is our cat. I'm just going to walk out. <laughs> I'm not, not saying anymore. What a, All right. what a strange bunch. Uh. <laughs> and, uh, All right, guys. I think I got a plan. I say we put Taiga as bait so we can practice that fist man karate. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. What, in the, gra in the graveyard? You know exactly. exactly what our next plan was there. Good job, Kai. It seems like uh, the correlation between her and the old man that got attacked was this graveyard. It was a young man yeah. that got attacked. Young man that got attacked. Young man. Yeah, okay. young man. Yeah. So, um, the fact that it showed up at this particular doorstep maybe was to send a message to not go near this graveyard. So there could potentially be some illegal doings over there. All right. Um, we well, could just like... Hey, I'm of the opinion out. we head straight to the graveyard, says uh, Cat and Spook, and we deal mm. with this ghost problem, and then... You Marines ain't gonna be needed anymore. I'll have everything under control. You know, we'll be the we'll judge of that. that. You don't but if we if we just show up as a as a big group, will the ghost show up? I think we need to make Tyga go there alone, and we'll watch from a distance and see what yeah, happens. Yeah, that's a smart yeah, idea. Yeah. yeah, he makes great bait. Hey, 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 guys! I was thinking actually of waiting at the ship and. Guarding it just in case any ghosts attack the uh, ship. Taiga, it'll be I okay. grab Taiga's head. Um, like Taiga, <laughs> you want to get a girlfriend one day, right? Yeah, but you not, gotta overcome not a, your fears. You're not a ghost girlfriend. No, I mean, if you could be, unless... if you could stay calm in front of a ghost, you can stay calm in front of a girl. <laughs> is you that, see, Taiga, this is part of your training. Is, is, wait, is is that true? Is that how it works? I mean, I don't think I panic in front of women. I, Listen, I, I'm, I'm great in front of women. They just don't like me. I turn him towards it's Yokan. True. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. Yokan is like, not, you know, Yokan's like different. Yokan's not like other girls. She's yeah, scary. She's a cat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she drinks milk and I'm lactose See, intolerant. Tiger, here's the thing. As a woman myself, I imagine that if you were to overcome a ghost... That women would probably love you. Not me, but other women, probably. <laughs> Definitely really? not me, but maybe somebody. <laughs> I don't see the logic in this, but All I right. seem to have more knowledge of this Tiger. than I do. You know what? You'll, okay. uh, You'll be okay. We'll watch you. Yeah, Here. no, I'll I mean, be fine. Like, you know what? I'll be fine. Women will Here. love me. I'm a hero. I'm Tiger. I'm a Marine. I'm I'm incredible. I, I, I'm going. Which way is a graveyard? Point me in that direction. I can't wait to get my hands on that ghost. I'll fuck him up. I like we'll, the enthusiasm. We'll, we'll have your back as well. I yeah. will have your back. In fact, here, take Belle. She'll it. guard you while you're out there so nothing bad happens to you. Okay? Yeah. Okay. All right. I'll um, give you Choppa. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's it. I actually, you know what? I give I give him Belle, and I also take one of my feathers off and use it as my hunter's mark and just tie it to his shirt so in case he disappears into the fog or some shit, yeah. I'll be able to track him. Okay. So I'll do that. You guys yeah. head on over to the graveyard then. And as you get to the edge of the graveyard, you, the fog grows thicker and thicker. Oh, yeah. You see oh, the yeah. tombs, um, the spooky ambient music starts playing. Um, and the Tiger. Copyright free. Yeah, spooky, spooky ambient, ambient music. music. And Tiger's quivering in his little boots. Uh, all right, guys. Uh, so you want me to just run into this graveyard and just beat the shit out of that ghost, right? Nah, you should hang yeah, out next much. to the creepiest grave possible for at least a couple hours until the ghost. I don't know when the ghost might show up. Actually, okay. Yokan could go with you technically. Like, yeah. No, no, I, I, I got this. A cat. I, I, I got this. I got this. I got this. I got this. I'm, I'm brave. Okay. I don't need any help. I don't need you any help. This. 
I, I lean over to Bradley. I'm going to sneak away and watch him from a distance yeah, anyways. Yeah, that's okay. Good idea. Yeah. Good idea. So, that's a good idea. Okay. Nearby. Tiger gets ready. He goes, all right, it's Tiger-tastic time. And he charges into the fog. And then there's like a moment right. of silence. And then, I'm gonna ah! fall. Oh. And then he, <laughs> he runs out of the fog. Oh my god, it's a ghost. He's actually, the ghosts are real. Ghosts are real. I re, you know, I recontextualize everything I've ever learned in my life. Oh my god. Oh god, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fucking die. I don't want to be a marine. I, I don't want to in the oh. fucking face. <laughs> okay. Calm down. What, what, what happened? Uh, I don't know. I saw, I saw a spectral figure and it was like, hello. And I was like, fuck you. And I ran away and I was terrified. And, uh, uh. Was it, uh, you sure it was a ghost and oh. not just a person? saying hello. No, 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 it was definitely a ghost. It was, it, I could see through, right through his fucking body, man. You don't understand. Okay. You haven't seen the things oh, that I've seen. Well, okay, <laughs> okay, you know what? Damien. Okay, Damien. okay, then bring us to this ghost. I'm bring us I, to I, this I, ghost. Yeah, 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 I, yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm, I'm fucking Captain Spook's like, let me fucking get him. And he puts the fucking gun over his, uh, his shoulder. Shit. He's like, I've got this. Please don't, please don't fire that thing off into the fog if you don't know what it is. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I, I actually already went forward to try and verify what was going okay, on. Okay, okay, so Damien, you're going on ahead. Uh, Captain Spook uh, is going on ahead. Captain Spook is close Damien. behind you. Yeah. And right, I'm walking go in. in too. Yeah. And as the, the fog sort of parts as you were walking in, you see sort of above a grave, there seems to be this shimmering, bluish, spectral figure. With tiny little glasses. It looks like an old man. And he just goes, Margaret, is that you? Are you? We just talked. We just talked to an old lady named Margaret. Margaret, have you returned? No, she's still quite alive. <laughs> just, mm -hmm. She may come back after all this is over. Don't talk to the to fucking it. ghost. And Captain Spook uh, pulls out the gun. And he's like, all right, time to say okay. sayonara, motherfucker. No, I, I knock the gun down. Like, if he's going to aim, I just smack that shit down with if it fires on the ground or something. I'm not letting him fire off into the Well, well he, he's like, you're going to get in the way of me and, and, and my prey? This ghost has yes. been killing people and terrorizing people. We, we don't know shit about this thing yet. I'm going to deal with this ghost, and if you get in my way, I've got to deal with you as well. I'm not letting him fire the gun at it. It's All right. not happening, well, so whatever you want to do. He points the gun at you, then. All right, you, then I'll are just... Are going to interfere with marine operations right now and attack See, us? See, okay, so this is okay for me to do this, Damien? I'm uh, telling him to back business. down if he doesn't want to back down. I'm, all right, I'm going to try to use my spirit. He's also pointing that gun at you. Yeah. 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 I'm, I'm going to let you think this through one more time. Are you sure you want to do that? He blows the gun. No witnesses. All right, all right we're doing it. <laughs> all right. <laughs> all right. Uh, all right. Um, how's this going? Um. Holy shit. Okay. Fine. We'll do it. We're, we'll do. We'll do combat. Um. So he 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 points the weapon at you, Kai. Yokan, you see this immediately happen, and you are first in the initiative order. What do you want to do? I'm just going to immediately take my quarter staff and just wallop this guy Go ahead. right in the side of the head. And I have two attacks now, oh, fun okay. fact. Yeah, extra oh, attack. Yeah. One of them hits so, uh, both of them hit. Oh, really? Okay. And then I'm also going to do my bonus action, one unarmed strike as well. Okay. And that also hits for nine plus three, so an extra 11. Oh my god, 15 plus 11. He just dies. Uh, Listen, this guy is just th just threatening to shoot Kai right in front oh, of him. Oh yeah, so he gets thing. fucking bloodied. He's like, hey, dude, fuck! Yeah, you've done it now! And he zoom, he points his fucking weapon out at, uh, at Kai, and it's gonna blast this pulse wave. Kai, I need you to do a strength saving throw. I'm not great at that, but I'll give it a go. 23! Oh, never mind! Oh, that's the wrong thing. Boom! <laughs> Um, yeah, you succeed, and you only take half damage. Right. Um, which is half of 25 is 12. 12 so 13. you take 12 damage, and you do not get pushed back. You remain yeah. in place. And he goes, Damn. That okay, that was cool. That was stronger than I expected. That killed everybody else I was trying to blast with it. Yeah. What makes I'm you fisherman. different? I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a fisherman. <laughs> Kai, go ahead. It's your turn. He's also not right. a ghost. All right, I'm not going to kill him. I'll just net him. Oh, shit. That That's doesn't hit. hit. Yeah. Okay. 
It's a critical fail regardless, so it just doesn't hit. Yeah, yeah, yeah it doesn't hit him. Um, it just like hey, keep that sh that net away from me. Yeah, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> it, like, sorry like, Bradley. you throw the net and it just sort of flies through the air. Fight! <laughs> I'm level five now. It doesn't matter. I get an extra attack. Go so ahead. I'm just gonna yeah. smack him with my bow to work. Uh, that, that does 18? hit. Okay, I guess that's not plus two for archery. It's just yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why we gotta right. fix that. Yeah, we gotta figure out the way that works. Okay. Yeah. Uh, you still hit though, and you do eight I'm damage. Doing eight. Okay. You smack him across the face. Boom! Blood <laughs> dripping down. Uh, Bradley, you're up. I'm gonna cast stealth. Cast. Cast spell. Cast. cast you. Stealth. <laughs> I'm now the last stealth. Thing, the last thing you want to do is challenge me in a graveyard full of fog. Do I get advantage on my roll? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, you're Man. thirty. All right. Damn. You're gonna creep I up. Wanna, like, I want to creep up behind him and like karate chop him on both sides of his neck. Do go ahead. Your your damage for your uh, sneak attack is higher now, right? Pardon? Your your the the amount of d6 you roll for a sneak oh, attack yeah. is higher now, right? So cool. I don't know if you've included that on your sheet yet. Whoa! Holy Damn. shit! I not okay, legally so... do it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so yeah, oh my god. Well, let me change it on your Sweet sheet. Dreams, Be Captain. Before you click the before you click okay. the number, let me change it on your sheet so that we can get the exact right amount here for damage. Oh boy. It is you get an extra three D6 now. This guy's um, gonna get karate into the next now fucking life. Click the button. It's gonna be sixty-six extra. Oh yeah. my god. Click the fish. Oh, I want to say, as I'm walking over, I'm like, now you see me, now you don't. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> oh. Go ahead. Sweet dreams, motherfucker. Uh, boom. So, 27 plus 14? 41. Oh, Ooh. my God. Yeah. yeah, I mean, you knock him. You knock him out. That was very close to being, like, enough to kill him straight out with massive damage. Uh, <laughs> Okay. You just come up, you fucking paralyze him, karate chopping him in the neck. He goes, oh, uh, and he collapses down to the ground. All right, that's combat over. Um, All right. I pick up his gun. <laughs> I'm like, um, anybody want this? <laughs> it's a pretty cool gun. It 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 tanked me pretty hard. Yeah, it's better in our hands rather than that. Does mm -hmm. anyone mm -hmm. here a ranger equipped to do? Uh, I mean, I, I can only be me. I, I, <laughs> I, actually, no, you. Yes. Yeah, I, yeah, I, I am a ranger. It says so on my. I pull out my fisherman's yeah. license. It's, yeah. It says. Yeah. I'm a ranger. <laughs> All right, oh, I'll hang on to it. Yeah. Sure. Cool. Yeah. You put it away. I has a pulse rifle now. <laughs> All right. Um, it is a reloading weapon. I do want to state. So, um, you have okay. to, you have to take an action to reload it, but you get, okay. you can use it. So, gotcha. Gotcha. um, yeah. Captain Spook, the ghost hunter, lies on the ground unconscious. Um, right there. So, uh, ghost, Sorry right. We that, turn Mr. back to ghost. the ghost. <laughs> <laughs> as, as I turned, I'm just going to completely ignore it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I turn back to the ghost. All right. What'd you say your name was? My name is Stanley. Ah. And how long have you been at this graveyard, Stanley? A few years now. Ever since I was buried here. I thought I'd be put to rest. Um, but it seems that I can't... I can't rest. Hold on, I don't mind guy. doing this real quick. Yeah. I'm going to put my Wait, hand so is he actually a quick. ghost? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm not watching yes. Damien. You put, you put your hand through him, he's 100% yeah. a ghost. Holy wow. shit. Right, Holy wow. shit. Holy shit. There are I'm ghosts. I'm going to have to write this down. All right, ghosts All exist. those people that we killed are ghosts now. Oh my god. Man, I thought ghosts were a myth. After so I... Wait, wait so does that mean there's an afterlife? Uh, well, no. apparently not, because this guy's... Yeah, Wide right. Away. So this is what we do after we die? We just hang out in graveyards for the rest of our life? No, I That's don't I don't lame. know what's supposed to happen after death, but Does I, this ghost wear clothing? I just I'm always Yeah, yeah, he's about he's, that. he's wearing okay. his little old man clothes. So you're just yeah, stuck okay. wearing that clothing you're the, buried in for the rest the, of the, life. The, okay, cool. The day that yeah. I was buried, Margaret visited me a couple of days. And then all of a sudden he just she just stopped visiting. And oh. I'm scared that she doesn't love me anymore, and I can't rest until I see my wife for one last time. 
Gotcha. I run back to her house, pick her up, what, and bring her back. What, what the fuck? <laughs> uh, mm. I assure you that she wants to come back, but apparently there's been some things going around town. Apparently ghosts are attacking, is what people are saying. Do you have any knowledge of any attacks going on? I would, that would I've be not attacked anyone. The only thing that I've ever seen is that man um, just will... randomly blast people in this graveyard. I look back over at Captain Spook's body. Well, I guess we took care of that then. Yeah. It turns out the ghost hunter was the ghost all along. Well, I don't know if that's exactly right. <laughs> I, I did. I did actually run back to the house to get the old lady. So. Oh, okay. We, we cut to Kai with the old lady. Yep. So you knock at the door. She goes, "Oh, hello, dearie. You didn't hey. actually finish your Battenberg. Have you come back for more?" Oh, absolutely. I would love some. Hey, so your husband, turns out ghosts are real. He's in the oh, graveyard right me. now. Yeah, and he Stanley? just can't pass on to the next life. Yeah, that was his name. And he just, he wants to see you one more time before he passes on to the next life. You've got a persuasion roll with this, because it is a okay. lot. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so that's, yeah, I admit. Uh, that's kind I of admit. a weird one. That's a wacky Oh, that's good friend. enough, though. 19. She All goes, right. Jesus. You want to go see your husband's spirit? I, oh, I at least want to visit his grave. And okay. if you're there to protect me from any sort of evil. Oh, we'll be. Yeah, he's not dangerous at all. The, the other guy, the guy that was in your house with the gun. Yeah, he was dangerous, but we knocked his ass out. Oh, I thought so. Yeah. You know what? He, he always struck, struck me as a little weird talking about wanting to take over this place and how mm. things would be better with him in charge and how things would be safer, and he was always saying stuff like we'd be have less dead bodies if he was... But I always Yeah, thought... I think, honestly, in hindsight, he might have been the prime culprit. Um, but hey, let's get going to the graveyard. You have a wheelchair or anything? Oh, I can make it, dear. I've oh, okay. got a walking stick. I'm All not right. that old. I'm 92. But I'm not Ooh, that... a, spr <laughs> a spry 92. Well, let's get going. I walk next to her, but I'm polite, and I don't, like, run too far ahead yeah. of her. I, like, keep... Unless so, she really is booking. I don't I don't know how fast she moves. So, what do you do, young man? You seem very nice. Oh, kind. I'm a fisherman. I fish for most of my day. <laughs> We're you just gonna fish? go... With... But aren't you friends with a fish? How does that work? <laughs> okay, so actually, I've been having a little bit of difficulty with that as of late. There was a situation, I'm not gonna bore you with it, but I accidentally netted my friend. Uh, hmm. That, does that was seem apparently a little polite. bit of a racism, which isn't cool, and I acknowledge that, but I just don't know how to make it up to him, okay? Oh, I hope you apologized. Listen. I did apologize, but it's one of those things where even if you apologize, it feels like it's something you just can't sweep under the rug. You kind of have understand. to. I you understand. Know. What's your yeah. name, my dear? My name's Kai. Kai, what a lovely name. Yeah. Listen, I'm sure if he's really your friend, he will forgive you. <laughs> and. You just have to show to him kindness and, and love to make up for for your lapse in judgment. The close Thank you. when Thank you're you, old Margaret. like me, you're going to wish that you kept the people close to you close. You remind me so much of my Graham Graham. I hope she was a wonderful lady. She's still alive, she just doesn't remember a lot of stuff. Okay. Uh, they say... Do I just, we just make it back to the yeah, graveyard? Yeah, 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 you make <laughs> okay. it back to the graveyard. Yeah. Yeah. While we're waiting for Kai, I'm going to cuff Mr. Spook over here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. His, little cat His unconscious body. <laughs> yeah. well, at this um, point, I, I'm guessing... As, I... as you <laughs> cuff Mr. Spook, you notice that on his back, he has this little machine that's, like, puffing out smoke. Um... Fuck he's yeah, got he's <laughs> you just turn can it I just curb stomp it yeah you can just oh. smash it yeah <laughs> just, um yeah he, he's just been having a he just has a smoke this machine is a fire has he has a yeah. smoke <laughs> dial he yeah. has a fog dial yeah. for and some then the, the fog starts to clear up oh, this guy's single-handedly <laughs> polluting this entire island that's got to be like a crime a in itself right <laughs> He's definitely, well, first off, he assaulted marine officers, so oh, yeah. I was going to lock him up, but you're right. He did pollute this entire island, so that's another thing he's going to be put away for. Um, Margaret and Kai enter the graveyard. Hey, guys. And okay. Margaret slowly hobbles over to Stanley's grave, and Stanley looks down at Margaret. Margaret, you came back to me. And Margaret looks up and goes, 
Oh, Stanley, you old bugger. I thought I'd never get to see you again. You never visited. That was because it was dangerous. But I promise, from now on, I will, I will visit every day. I'll visit every day, my love. And they embrace. The, the ghost wraps his arms around Margaret. Margaret wraps his arms around the ghost. As Stanley closes his eyes. Thank you. I could die happy. A life with you was the greatest life I could ask for. And the old lady looks up as Stanley's spirit drifts off into the sky. Into like a glow? Yeah. Huh. Um, okay. Oh. So there's an afterlife now, I guess, guys. That's information that not everybody knows. I'm writing it down. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm writing it down too. <laughs> Shit. And Margaret then so... turns around and sees Captain Spook on the ground and just hits hits him with her walking stick. <laughs> and you've been a bad, bad boy. Bad boy. All right. Do you have any information there? Because I didn't hear anything that you said to Kai. <laughs> bad boy. I mean, I know he assaulted us, but... I, I didn't think oh, he uh, yeah, apparently he's been going around town a lot, like, saying that the world would be better with let more people dead. So he's very clearly a serial killer. I just, uh, yeah. Oh, so he was the one that was been murdering everyone then. Mm, <laughs> most definitely, yes. I hear that, and I grab my staff and start smacking his body. Yeah, wait, the old lady. <laughs> the old lady. <laughs> you start I mean, the hands, the shit. Any, Happy, I mean, Happy Halloween, everybody. Happy Halloween, everybody. I don't think any candy's gonna come out. He's not a pinata. <laughs> yeah. He, he like, he vomits Unless. up like a couple sweets. He, he vomits up the battered burg that you guys were eating. <laughs> oh, no. Um, and I guess on that scene, <laughs> Happy <laughs> Halloween, <laughs> and it's short Happy and Halloween. sweet. Spooky episode uh, yeah, yeah. to be continued. That was great. Okay, interesting. That's what we I love that. Yeah. <laughs> that was a lot simppler than I thought it was. Yeah, I mean, it's a nice little, yeah, little just little thing you know, going on. That's yeah. it. We didn't have a ton of time. Nah, it's cool. It's all right. It's just a fun little... Hey, okay. hey nice little yeah. self-contained story. I thought there was going to be a twist to it. Like, Margaret was going to go up to Stanley and just be like, Stanley, you cheating son <laughs> 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 like, oh, okay, now that makes more sense like, now. Why she didn't show up? It was just simple, like, oh, okay. 